I want to walk you through the process of enabling secure credential storage in Docker. I'll be demonstrating on Ubuntu Server 18.04, but the platform doesn't matter so long as it supports the Docker container engine. Let's get to work. Without a GUI, you need to install RNG tools with the command sudo apt-get install rng-tools-y. Once the installation completes, generate the required entropy with the command sudo rngd-r slash dev slash urandom. Next, install the pass tool with the command sudo apt-get install pass-y. Now we can generate a new GPG key with the command gpg dash dash full dash generate dash key. Answer the following questions for the key. The type of key. Select the default. Key size. Select the default. Key validity. Select the default. Save the values by typing Y. Next, type the name, email address, and optional comment, and then type O to save the key. When prompted, type and verify the password for the new key. Create a new directory with the command mkdir tilde slash bin. Change into that newly created directory with the command cd tilde slash bin. Add the directory to your path with the command echo quote export path equals dollar sign path colon tilde slash bin quote greater than greater than tilde slash dot bash rc. Download Docker Credential Pass with the command wget https colon slash slash github.com slash docker slash docker dash credential dash helpers slash releases slash download slash v0.6.3 slash docker dash credential dash pass dash v0.6.3 dash amd64 dot tar dot gz. Untar the downloaded file with the command tar xvzf docker dash credential dash pass dash v zero dot six dot three dash amd six four dot tar dot gz. Give the new file the proper permissions with the command chmod a plus x docker dash credential dash pass. Copy the executable with the command sudo cp docker dash credential dash pass slash user slash local slash bin. With the installation of Docker credential helpers taken care of, log out and log back into the server and then create a new directory with the command mkdir tilde slash dot docker. Next, you must initialize the pass tool. To do this, locate your gpg id with the command gpg dash dash list dash secret dash keys. Locate the id associated with the key you want to use and then initialize pass with the command pass init string, where string is the gpg key ID you want associated with the credential storage. Now we'll create a password for the credential storage with the command pass insert docker dash credential dash helpers slash docker dash pass dash initialized dash check. Once your password is generated, create a new configuration file with the command sudo nano tilde slash dot docker slash config dot json. Add the following content to the new file. Brace, double quote, experimental, double quote, colon, double quote, enabled, double quote, brace. Save and close the file. Finally, log in to Docker with the command docker login. If you want to learn more in the ways of everything tech, be sure to subscribe to our Tech Republic YouTube channel and watch more how-to videos at How to Make Tech Work.